We felt that it was going to be a factor and that if we could get a couple of goals ahead in the first half it would be we'd been with a good chance in the second and uh, we should have got a couple of goals. We got one, we hit the post and Theo pulled off a couple of great saves but uh, it wasn't to be. But it, it was just good to see us playing such attacking football against a team at the top of the league, by far at the top of the league and away from home and then working as hard as we could to hold on to something at the end and last five minutes got us. Two of the players, two of the players, Manny Musket and um, and uh, Ben Sigmund lost three and a half kilos, which is three and a half litres of water, so they were really struggling. Oh, I, the, the, the support has been terrific. The, the, the fact that we get so many uh, members and supporters that are so excited about us playing and en enjoying every game, uh, I'm sure that will build. And up in Auckland, uh, it, it seems that there's a very strong crowd, but also Roy Krishna has stimulated a lot of, uh, of uh, what maybe supporters that wouldn't normally come along are going to come along to the game, so I think the crowd will be very good up in Eden Park. Well, uh, I think the way we're playing, the strikers are getting better service now. Um, oh, watch out! That must have been one of our shots at goal that hit me in the back there. <laughs> um, Stein and uh, up front is getting really good service. Uh, all the strikers are working hard to get into goal scoring positions because they have to understand it, you score 25 metre top left hand corner shots every now and again. Most goals are a tap in inside the six yard box. So we work very hard to get players in the box when the service is delivered. Plus, we're getting pretty good service from Carlos, Vince, Jason Hicks did a good job, uh, Albert Riera, and uh, and He's make, Stein's making the most of that. He's, he's finishing as good. He's got a great, great left foot. I can put him at number 10 or up front and he does a job for us. So it's just great to see that he's top goal scorer in the league. Carlos has played 60 minutes in total and uh, Kenny played 90 minutes of the first game and 20 minutes of the second game. So we have to assess them medically and physically whether they're fit. I'm assuming they will be. They've got plenty of time to uh, and they're flying up with us to Auckland. We've got plenty of time to uh, help them recover. So the thinking is they'll go straight back into the team, but it'll depend on their, how they're feeling and uh, their health and well-being. Adelaide are similar in that they're trying to play a possession game of football. They're scoring goals and they've been on a good run. So it's going to be a very tough match, but a very exciting match. And it allows us to compare ourselves with teams around the same area. We're all fighting for that top six spot so it's a Auckland's going to get a good show yeah I tend to look two or three games ahead and the last two or three games were against teams in the top half uh, whether it be the Wanderers or the Roar uh, Sydney etc so this this one is going to be very similar to us teams all fighting for that and they're not easy games they're going to be very tough games but almost six point games so we're playing for double points, so it's very important that our performances are right. Get the performance right, the results look after themselves.